Hello everyone. In this question, we'll draw ray diagrams for the case of different images formed in the concave mirrors. So first, we'll start from the object kept at infinity. Then we'll move forward towards the ports. So first, we'll write the rays diagrams for each case of concave mirror is shown below. Here. U is equals to object distance, V is equals to image distance, and N is nature of image, where S is size of image. So, first we'll draw the first case that is the object is kept at infinity. So, here is our ray diagram. In this, the rays are coming from infinity and after reflecting, that is, if they are coming from infinity, they should be parallel to the principal axis. And the rays parallel to principal axis are converged to a focus. So, the image is formed at focus. So, the image distance will be at focus. The nature is real as the real rays are meeting, hence the nature of the image will be real and if it is real it should be inverted also so the nature is real and inverted the size we can see we cannot see the image here hence it is very small the diminished size so we'll write points image highly diminished now for the second case our object will come closer that is beyond center of curvature so, here is our ray diagram, here is our pole, here is our focus, here is our center of curvature and the object is kept beyond center of curvature. First ray is falling parallel, so hence it will pass through the focus and the other ray is passing through center of curvature, hence it will go unaffected. So, the image is formed at point this that is between our center of curvature and focus and as we can see the image formed is totally inverted and also the size of the image is not same it is quite small that is it it is diminished so we'll write first the image distance between c and f that is center of curvature and focus the nature is real and inverted as seen by us and the size is diminished. Next, the third part will come more closer and the object will be kept at center. So, if we see the ray diagram, the object is at the center of curvature and the ray first ray is coming parallel, hence it will pass through the focus and the second ray is going from focus hence it would be parallel the image is formed just below the center of curvature but it is totally inverted it is of the same size but it is totally inverted so first of all the object distance is at c and the image distance is also at c the nature is real and inverted as it is formed by the real rays, the size is same size. Next, we'll move, move to the next case that is, will come more closer. So, it would be between C and F, between focus and center of curvature. This is our ray diagram. As we can see, that the object is kept between focus focus and center of curvature so first ray is moving parallel hence it will it will pass through focus and the second ray is passing through center of curvature so as we can see that the object is small and the image is huge hence the image is magnified and also it is formed by the real reflected rays hence the image is real and also inverted so it is formed beyond c so we'll write our v is beyond c nature is real and inverted 
and also the size is magnified. Now the next case is at focus as it will come more close be between C and F was our last case. Now it will come more close so it will be at focus. So this is our ray diagram. If we see it, the object is kept at focus and the first ray is coming parallel. Hence, it will, it will pass through focus and the second ray is passing through center of curvature. As our rays cannot meet here, they'll meet somewhere at infinity. So, our image would be formed at infinity. Also, it is be below our principal axis. Hence, the image will be inverted as well as they are formed by the merge of real reflected rays hence the re images would be real and also they would be very much magnified so we'll write the image distance is at infinity nature is real and inverted and also the size is highly magnified our last case is the object is kept between focus and pole so when the object is kept between focus and pole this is a special case where we we will find that the image is virtual and erect it is not like the other cases in which the images were real and inverted here the object is kept between focus and the pole the object is here. First of all, the light is falling at some angle. So it would be reflected at the same angle. So our second ray is passing through center of curvature. So it will cover the same path. So now we have extended these two rays backward. That is the ray coming from center of curvature and the ray that was at some angle and the meet at this point. Here our image is formed. That is A dash b dash so our image is formed behind the mirror a mirror is here and the image is formed behind the mirror also we can see that they are formed by the virtual rays hence the image is virtual and also as we can see it is erect also the size of the object was small and the image is huge hence it is magnified so we'll write the image distance is behind the mirror the nature is virtual and erect and also the size is magnified imaged so i hope you have understood all the six cases of the images formed from a concave mirror thank you